Hello everyone and welcome to Vacationing From Home. This is the YouTube channel where I visit resorts from home. Today I'm going to be exploring the You and Me Resort by Cocoon. It is in the Maldives, so if you're interested, let's start. We're going to start by showing you where this is located. This is located in the Maldives, like I said, so it's right off of India on that south west side. Kind of scroll in here. There are a whole slew of small islands in the Maldives. Here is where the UME Resort specifically is at. This resort basically takes up the entire island. They do mark out where some of their other uh, interests are on the island here, but we'll get into that more when we talk about the resort. We're gonna start with the experiences uh, for the specific resort that they offer. I think it is kind of interesting how they map this out. So let's dive into what they have to offer here at the resort. So one of the things they offer is a photo shoot with a photographer. You can actually get um, professional photos taken. I think that's kind of a cool idea, especially maybe if you're not too savvy with the camera, you didn't bring a nice one along and you just have your phone. Maybe you don't want to bring your phone along while you're on these beautiful islands enjoying your vacation. Obviously, they do weddings here. It's a beautiful island. What a beautiful place to get married. You can dig more into that. I'm sure you have to call them and specifically get quotes there. They do offer diving here at the resort. They have an entire list that you can go down. They specifically rate out everything that they offer. Um, BCD jacket, regular things that you wouldn't normally bring along probably in a carry-on or your pack luggage. You can rent out basically your whole entire dive suit um, here and they offer a variety of packages when you when it comes to diving out in the ocean They do offer a lot of water sports here. I'm gonna click into this price list here I really do appreciate that they list everything and every single cost available so you can kind of plan out your budget along um, With that they have snorkeling available so you can rent out your fins your mask your snorkel they have a catamaran sailing, windsurfing, kite surfing. All these are kind of priced out based off of how long you want to be out there. They have jet ski rentals, water skiing, banana boats, flyboard lessons, parasailing, which I think would be pretty fun. And they also have big game fishing. They also have excursions that you can buy here. Um, they have sunset dolphin cruise, um, picnicking on an island, sunset fishing, a romantic cruise, sunrise fishing, and local island tours. Oh, and you can actually go snorkeling with manta rays, which I think would be very cool. And they also have big game fishing. Once again, they have a whole list of pricing available. Uh, they break it down per person, depending on what you choose to do. For the entertainment, they have a live band, DJ, a cultural show, which I think would be interesting to check out. They have a sandbag party and a white party, which I'm assuming you just all dress up in white outfits for that. They also have a fitness center and a variety of fitness activities to do. They have yoga and beach tennis, beach volleyball, Zumba, Pilates, and some aqua fitness classes. So let's talk about dining. This is the first thing I saw when I looked up this resort and I thought it was pretty neat, so that's why I kind of want to dive into this resort itself. They have a resort called H2O. It is an underwater dining experience. This is a restaurant that is completely under the water. You can enjoy the sea life while you're having a meal. I think that is absolutely fantastic. I'm sure you do have to book this one in advance because I'm sure everyone kind of wants to dine out in this environment. Then they have the green carpet, it is called. It is located near the pool. It sells lunch options. Next, they have the Sand Restaurant. It is the main restaurant, and they also serve breakfast and dinner here, and they have live cooking stations. Here's a picture of the food items available and some of the views from the restaurant there. It looks like you just get to look right out into the ocean where you're eating, which I think is absolutely fabulous. They also have the Rising Sun Restaurant, which is a Japanese-focused restaurant. They have La Pasta Restaurant, which is an Italian-focused restaurant. They are located on the beach and they serve Italian food, which is basically pastas and some pizzas. The last one is the Cheers Bar. They serve um, specialty cocktails and a variety of wine, champagne, and they also have live music for their entertainment. And it looks like they are also right on the beach and they also have a pool table available. And no resort would be complete without a spa. They have the UME Spa where they feature Elizabeth Arden as their products that they use there. All right, last but not least, let's talk about the rooms available here. The first one is the Manta Villas. They are located in the lagoon. These villas overlook the ocean. They have polished wooden floors, a king-size bed, 
rain shower, and a seaside deck. The Dolphin Villa is another room you can pick. There's only 15 of these. These are also located in the Lagoon. They come with a king size bed, a rain shower, and also a sea deck. One of their other rooms that are available are the Dolphin Villas. This comes with a pool though. The next one you can choose is a beach suite with a pool. It also has a king size bed, a private pool, and a private beach area. They have an aqua suite you can choose from. This one has a large bathroom with a rain shower, couple's bathtub, a king size bed overlooking the ocean, and a large outdoor deck to relax and sunbathe. They have another aqua suite you can choose from. This one, however, has a pool attached. The last one is the you and me suite. They only have one of these rooms available. It has one large bedroom, a bathroom, a couple's tub, a huge living space, a recreation room with private gym, cinema, and massage table. It also has its own private pool. This is the probably the most expensive one that you can probably get. All right, let's go to TripAdvisor next because I always love going to TripAdvisor. This is rated uh, out of the thousand reviews. They rate it about 4.5 stars. It is number four out of the 15 hotels in its area. All right, that's it for the UME Resort by Cocoon. This resort is located in the Maldives. If you have been to this resort, please tell us down below what you liked, what you didn't like, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.